I'm going to read Original Innocence from Durham and Rose. Innocence is something I can no longer see in myself. It has become a color I have lost, a blind spot growing ever larger in the center of my vision, and a hole gaping at the center of my heart. Did I give it away, or was it taken? Probably both, if I had to say. And though it is gone and gone for good, I can still recall exactly when I last saw it, so alive and so immediate that it made me tremble and smile inside and feel again my own hope, my own original innocence rekindled, if only for an instant, in those deep green Michigan woods. Where and when I cradled the yet unnamed baby Esther in my arms, so small and so warm, and her mother's blankets bundled pressed closely to my heart, carrying her crying as I ran from the cabin where she was born, away from her father's madness, suicide, and death, out of the darkness of that ancient wood and into the electric light of ironwood street lamps, humming, I can hear her voice, and I can still smell her, all mother's milk and rice pudding, sweet and close and warm. But the actual innocence and its spark that I saw so brilliant and bright in her newly opened eyes that night, those things... I've slipped away, fled from my memories, and left me more empty than before. And so I ask myself that crippling question once more, with its crippling answer, how did I lose it? How did I lose my own original innocence and the goodness with which all of us are first born? Did I give it away? Did I make some sort of lopsided trade? Or... Was it God himself? Did he take it from me on the day of my first real action with all my killing in the German trenches when from him first I turned away?